Another throw to the shots, third one now. Amaluza, can he get his ball across? He can. Oh, what a great effort from Jack Barham. He just drilled it low across uh, Amaluza and Barham ran towards the near post, just flicked at it with the outside of his right foot. Here's Amaluza holding the ball up. Oh, nice turn from him. A little bit of room, tries a shot. Little deflection. And Arnold does well because the deflection steered it more towards the corner of the goal. And you wondered just for a moment, Craig, whether that one might creep in. Ball into the chest of Barham. Uh, Glover gives it back. Amaluza, can he pull it back? He does. Oh, oh, Barham has an effort. It's on target and it comes off of Hobson and goes behind for a corner. Here's uh, Mooney going through the middle, slips the ball into Rhys Murphy. And he scores. One chance, one ball. Low down to Ashby Hammond's left. He goes all the way back to Ashby Hammond, who finds... Tyler Cordner. Tyler Cordner skips in between a couple of players. Tries a through ball. ball. It's a really a good ball, ball to Jack Barham. He could be in one on one here. Oh, he's put it wide, and we'd expect better of Jack Barham. Another brilliant through ball from Tyler Cordner. He's shown so many times he can do it. So, 25 yards out, as we look at the South End goal, left of centre, Cordner steps away from it. Penderbury steps up, and it's over the bar. Here's another ball poked forward by Rhys Murphy. Oh, Cordner in two touches, just completely lost his man and fed Pendlebury. He's bursting through the middle here. Can he get his ball through to Frost? He can. To the edge of the area, cuts inside. Can he get shot away? He can. Is he fouled as he goes? No, nothing given. He's put it wide. Another effort goes begging Joe for the shot. Uh, here's Amaluza. Will he get one last opportunity? No, he's been dispossessed. There's a ball through the middle and Rhys Murphy can't quite take it under control. It goes all the way back to Ashby Hammond. He bowls it out to Cordner, who's picked it up on the left in a bit of space. And the half-time whistle goes. Uh, so then come forward. The ball's immediately in touch. And be, oh, it's a poor ball from him. And he feeds it straight to, of all people, Dan Mooney. But there's a really good tackle from Kenlock. An order shot have won it back. And Class exchanges passes with Partington and then sets Amaluza away on the left-hand side. Quick feet, turns, comes back inside to Class. Class takes it nicely, finds Pendlebury. Pendlebury's going to try a shot from a long way out and it's on target and saved away to his right by Steve Arnold. Uh, Aldershot have a throw, Glover will take, he takes it quickly to Cordner who's well forward, steps on the ball, then gets past his man, then gets down the right, puts a cross in, it's missed by one, poked half clear, follow up shot from Pendlebury, uh, deflection and behind for another corner to the shots. Class into Barham, will Barham get one more chance this afternoon and will he take it? Uh, oh, good move, Matt Amazula picks it up, it's Frost into the area, comes it through yes! and it's finished! Finally at the 10th attempt, Aldershot Town! score in front of the fans 420 of them 63 minutes gone it's been coming here's that man again all oh, over the bar this time from uh, tyler frost South End have lost the ball from the free kick, but Partington's clearance will only find Kensdale. Partington wins it again and heads it to Barham, who just hooks the ball over. It's headed back. Oh, Amaluza could be in here. He oh, it's a penalty to Has yeah. to be Amaluza taken yeah. out by Steve Keeper. Arnold, who will get a yellow card. And Aldershot have got a penalty here. We hope that Amaluza's OK. His footwork was so quick. Hutchinson's not on the pitch, so the skipper Joe Partington's going to take it. He's going to step up now, right-footed. Oh, and he's buried it right in the top corner. And the shots have come be from behind to lead here at Roots Hall, right on the 70-minute mark. 20 minutes to go, South End United 1, Aldershot Town 2. Partington takes it and goes backwards to Pendlebury. Pendlebury's going to have a shot from distance. What a great strike. It's parried away and followed up but cleared by Southend, only as far as Partington. He sends the ball out to the right-hand side. That's probably going to find touch, unless Bridge keeps it in. He does. He pokes it back to Ralph. Desperation here for both sides. Ralph sends it into the air. It's headed away by McCoy, only as far as Scott Morris. He tries a shot from distance. It's well parried away by Ashby Hammond and then cleared forward by Kenlock down by the corner flag. That's it. There is the final whistle. Aldershot have done it in the tour of duty. 
Southend United 1, order shot 2. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.